Director of Sports Tourism Development at the Ministry of Tourism, Tyrone Sawyer, says that the upcoming Atlantis Crown Gymnastics event is expected to bring some 3,000 visitors to our shores. The event is scheduled for the weekend of December 16, uh, 2011, and it's being held, as the name implies, at Atlantis. And we're looking forward to some great things from the event in terms of the spend in, in, into the destination, into our economy, and in terms of the family members and friends. Because gymnasts, of, you know, especially small kids, they always bring the parents, they bring siblings. So it's a classic fusion of our efforts with the local federations in order to stimulate tourism to the country. Sawyer says that during the upcoming winter months, there are a number of events that will stimulate sports tourism. Marathon Bahamas, now in its third year, is also on the drawing board. It's an event, Marathon Bahamas is, where we've seen it really executed very professionally. And I keep saying this because one could be in Sydney, Australia, or in London, England, or Shanghai, China, and one is not going to be able to see an event more beautifully executed. So as a result of that alone, we're going to see more, not only local Bahamians, but visitors come forward and participate. We're looking forward to that. The Ministry of Tourism official says that slowly the Bahamas is becoming a force to reckon with in sports tourism. We've got uh, another event coming up uh, in Grand Bahama. It's a law enforcement sports challenge and it's at a classic time in January when we could use the additional tourism. So there's going to be more information coming on that one shortly. For the Tourism Today Network, I'm Gina Seeley.